that uh, for the first time, in fact, in the history of the state, uh, some major interventions in regards to the utility of the land that is owned by the government and the different departments of the government uh, is being done uh, in Shillong City. Close to about 25 acres of land belonging to government uh, is going to be rationalized and uh, we will try to utilize maximum uh, the entire land utility uh, with the objective of uh, decreasing the congestion in the city, uh, creating more uh, walking space and uh, creating overall more beautification for Shillong City. So uh, behind me as you can see that we have the uh, Barak uh, point and this is uh, a PWD land area. Uh, there is a plan to completely uh, utilize this to create uh, an open space for the public, uh, create a parking space on the side and have small uh, uh, you know, buildings which will be more like museums and promote the culture of, us, uh, of our uh, state and the history of our state. Uh, at the same time have small uh, uh, eating joints and small place where uh, you know, tourists can come in and uh, really get an experience of Shillong City. Uh, at the same time, uh, right here, we also intend to have a very uh, high uh, national flag hoisted here, uh, which will be, as I said, at the heart of the city, uh, which will again be a very strong icon in the, city of the, in the center of the city, which again will send a very strong message. Uh, so that is what the plan is for uh, the Barik uh, uh, point out here. And we expect that uh, by July end or by August, we should be able to uh, shift the offices from here and uh, start the work uh, maybe sometime in the month of September and uh, quickly be able to convert this into a nice open space, a green space and a space where tourists can really enjoy the city.